YouTube. It's 1 p.m. local time in here in the Maldives, and I'm here for just a bit over a week, staying at the Kanduma Holiday Resort. First off, I've got to pick up my luggage and then head down to the marina. I believe it's only about 100 metres, 200 metres away, and um, get my speedboat out to the island. Chopping tolls, about 45 minute trip. I just had a look at my paperwork. I have to find desk number 45. Apparently my speedboat driver will be waiting there for me, take me to the marina. Welcome to the capital of the Maldives, the city of Mali. As you can see, it is pouring rain, which is making boarding our speedboat a challenge. The 45 minute boat ride over to Kanduma Island was a little rough, but not too bad. Just check out the welcome sign the housekeeper left on my bed. It's made from palm leaves. Absolutely stunning. The room was of good size and the bed was very comfy. I absolutely love the outside bathroom. Just check it out. Unfortunately, the rain continued all night, however, cleared up the next morning. Well, the island I'm on, guys, is roughly about 100 acres. So it's not a small island. Sorry, it's not a large island. And it takes you about 15 minutes to walk around. And every room's got a view on the beach, which is perfect. And um, yeah, we'll have a quick look around the island and I'll show you what's here. guys and now I'll um, walk around the other side of the island and I'll show you the big pool they got here and um, yeah the um, cafes and the restaurant they got there. <laughs> Accommodation here, they have roughly 150 odd rooms, and apart from the ones over the water and background there, they're all pretty well the same inside. Have a large king size bed. If you wish singles beds, you can ask for that at, when you book it. Yeah, they all have a king size bed, fridge, and have coffee and tea making facilities. Yeah, if you ever want anything, just call up the reception and they'll bring it to you. You can even order meals if you don't want to sit at the, uh, the uh, bar or the um, restaurant for a meal yeah, just call up and they'll deliver it to your room free of charge and everything is in US dollars guys so just take that into account the conversion rate and it's plus 10% GST and 12% service charge so it's not cheap for food and drinks here but you're in paradise so why not spend up got to say guys they also have um, on hire any sport, um, surfing equipment you want like surfboards uh, they got jet skis and um, obviously hot equipment like um, snorkels, flippers and um, life jackets. Yeah, anything really. So most of it's all free. Some of it you've got to pay for. And um, it's all, again, it's all in US dollars. I'll um, try and put a price list below. But yeah, they have everything you need here. Unless you want to bring your own gear. But yeah, they have everything. If you don't, you can hire it. The reason I'm here in the Maldives is for a music festival. Every September, apart from the last two due to COVID, Jimmy Barnes and his family come to the Maldives at Kadumba Resort and it's Music in Paradise Music Festival. And there's roughly about 200 guests 
that come along and I'm one of them this year so I'm pretty lucky so it's here for eight eight days seven nights and they have concert uh, five nights of the week so tonight will be the first concert Jimmy Barnes and hopefully Mossy will get up because Ian Moss is here as well so it should be a great night but yeah that's the reason I've come over here I'm a huge Jimmy Barnes fan so um we're on the first day here or first morning to wake up so I'm just booked a uh, snorkeling trip so we're gonna get my gear ready and head down to the boat Um, to, in this morning snorkel there's a few fish obviously you know, shouldn't um, go near because they're dangerous and one of them is called the trigger fish I'll put some um, video footage on just after this um, yeah I met one um, well I was diving the other day for the turtles and I saw this um, orangey blue fish eating coral like biting it and, and apparently yeah, they're dangerous and they're very aggressive if you get too close, especially in breeding season, they chase you and they just bite you and they take big chunks of meat out of you. So I'm glad the one I looked at was um, reasonably friendly and didn't do bother about me being near him filming. So I'll show you what that fish looks like. But yeah, if you come to the tropics, I'm not sure if that fish is in Great Barrier Reef or not. But it's definitely in the Maldives and Indian Ocean. And it's um, if you see one, you should swim away from it. Yeah, so I'm here in the Maldives on Kaduma Resort Island for seven nights, eight days. And I'm here to see Jimmy Barnes, Mossy and family put on five performances during the week. So I'm looking forward to that. The first one's tonight, Jimmy Barnes, and hopefully Mossy will get up and do a few songs with him. So I'm really looking forward to that. So I'm just cooling off in this lagoon. And then I'll uh, go get changed and head down to, what is it, Surface Corner, the first one is. That should be good, just on the other side of the island. Short 10 minute walk, and hopefully I'm allowed to film there for you guys, and I'll show you a few clips of the concerts during the week. Accommodation on the beach that's literally 30 meters from the lagoon and they're virtually identical. And they are circled around the whole entire island. So it doesn't matter which one you really choose for a nice uh, view. They've all got beach views. Guys, I'm just gonna finish off my beer and tonight heading down to Surface um, Corner to see Mossy perform tonight. I'm looking forward to that one. 
I reckon it's going to go off. So um, next time you see us, we'll be down, hopefully front row at Mossy. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> ah, easy, easy. Ah. Oh, oh, good catch. <laughs> Thanks to these guys for looking out. morning snorkel yeah, before coming back for breakfast yeah, and just relaxing on the beach going for swims went for a walk around the island yeah it's a really nice day well, probably the best day of the whole whole week sun was out and the blues in the water are absolutely stunning well tonight guys we have uh, the Jane Barnes band so I'm looking forward to that I'm not sure if that's uh, just gone down to the reception I'm not sure if that's gonna be at surface corner again or up on the sun deck hopefully it's up on the sun deck because um, I reckon there'll be a nice sunset tonight I'll wander down to reception and then we'll check out the James Barnes band to this um, lifestyle guys yeah, absolutely beautiful location the Maldives in the morning I get up really early and we go for a snorkel come back have a shower head down have some breakfast then yeah go for a swim in the lagoon wander around just relax here in the deck of my um, accommodation and uh, listen and watch the um, ocean okay nothing better I'll just spin you around and have a look at the view yeah, not a bad view, you can't quite see the sea through the trees, but basically if you can see those two deck chairs over there, they're just right on the edge of the beach, which is what, about 20 metres away. Well, the crew is uh, setting up for tonight's um, final concert on Main Beach. Tonight's concert will feature Jimmy Barnes, Mahalia Barnes, Ian Moss and the rest of the crew, and I think it's really going to go off, and I cannot wait. We thought we'd start up all sentimental tonight. You know, stand here from here. 
Well guys, what an awesome week in paradise here on Kanduma Island Resort. During the day I snorkeled, relaxed on the beach under a palm tree, swam in a beautiful lagoon. I uh, went out snorkeling with the sharks and um, saw some um, turtles which is a bonus and um, at night we had some awesome concerts every night with uh, Jimmy Barnes, the Jane Barnes band, Mahalia Barnes, Ian Moss and um, the kids. So it's been an absolutely awesome uh, week guys. I can't wipe my smile off my half face. So until next time, take care and I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now. Thanks for watching Legends, please subscribe, hit the bell icon which will encourage me to create more content like this. Until next time, take care and I'll see you in the next video.